win an adventure is this big. Fear me if you dare. If we need an expert on licking ourselves, we'll give you a call. And a love is this strong. We need a little time to be together. Oh, okay. Now, where were we? Donkey! Once hey upon now, a time. Tricking Donkey on another whirlwind adventure. On, just on, isn't enough. Give me that. Hey but, 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 now, you're a stallion, baby! Shrek dear. Donkey? I took some magic potion, and now I'm sexy! Hey now, you're an all-star. Happy birthday to you. You live in a zoo. You look like a monkey. And you smell like one, two. two. <laughs> I say. Welcome to the Central Park Zoo. Most animals know a lot more than we think. Mm-hmm, I know that's right. They have feelings. We don't belong here. It's just not natural. This is all some kind of whacked out conspiracy. They make plans. Today we're gonna blow this dump. I did it! And sometimes... I wished I could go... to the wild! They want more out of life. The penguins are gone, so why can't I? The penguins are psychotic. <laughs> I didn't see anything. This summer. This place is crack a lacking DreamWorks Animation presents. Here come the people. Oh, I love the people. Hey, oh, can't you can't. Yeah. Oh, lady, what is wrong with you? Hey, kitty. Ben Stiller, Chris Rock, David Schwimmer, Jada Pinkett Smith. It's the man. We've been ratted out, boys. Madagascar. Cute and cuddly, boys. Cute and cuddly. Two of the most beloved animated characters of all time are coming to the big screen at last. Oh, why'd you come in? From the filmmakers that brought you the runaway box office hit, Chicken Run. Let's rock and roll! Ardman and DreamWorks Animation are collaborating for a feature-length adventure starring the dynamic duo Wallace and Gromit. Wallace and Gromit are a global phenomenon whose short films have garnered two Academy Awards and have been translated into over 20 languages. Creator and Oscar winner Nick Park is teaming up with Steve Box to direct the wildly inventive film. Oh, very cheeky. It just feels great to finally get Wallace and Gromit out there on the big screen. It's been one of those really long ambitions I've had, actually, for many, many years. Right, off we go, then. Wallace is a good-natured, eccentric, cheese-loving inventor. I'm just crackers about cheese. Gromit, his faithful canine companion, doesn't express himself in words, but his body language speaks volumes. There's a good dog. Their adventure begins in a small town in England where the townspeople are preparing for their giant vegetable competition. It's a veritable, vegetable paradise. Wallace and Gromit are called into action to investigate reports of a mysterious garden-guzzling beast. I feel we're on the cusp of a real breakthrough, lad. The whole humor of it all is that it's all in this little cozy northern town and, uh, uh, you know, with cups of tea and crackers and things, but it, that, it just grows exponentially from there and it becomes a kind of a mega adventure. Oh, charming. It's no small task for the creative team to bring the delightful duo to life. From sets to wardrobe to facial expressions, every detail of the unique animation style is tailored to create the fantastic world of Wallace and Gromit. All in a night's work, Mrs. Mulch. Alongside a host of new characters, the movie features Ray Fiennes as the pompous snob Victor Quartermain. No nonsense with Victor Quartermain. What you see is what you get. And Helena Bonham Carter plays Lady Toddington, an aristocrat who harbors a secret crush on Wallace. Please, Wallace, call me Totty. Well, I've always been a fan of Wallace and Gromit. I mean, I've always loved them. 
and they've got such sweet hearts. Oh, oh thanks, Chuck. <laughs> You'll go crackers for the inventive world of Wallace and Gromit. Only in theaters, October 2005. Job well done, lad. <laughs>